Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you a little video about how Lolo lids work and how they actually keep your beer colder from the sun longer than a regular beer cozy. So I'm going to start off by grabbing two Budweiser's from the fridge and opening these both up. Okay, so here's a shot of our beers. Uh, they're both pretty close to the same temperature here. Um, I'll go ahead and take the warmer one and we'll put it in the Lolo lids. Take our one beer and we'll snap this one on to the Lolo lid, like so. And then we'll line up the spout and we'll put this into this cup. Now the other beer I've already got inside of a beer cozy I got from free from work and we'll stick the thermometers in here. So at about five minutes in and the beer in the Lolo is about one degree cooler than the beer in the Cozy. So, about 10 minutes in, uh, the one in the Lolo is about 9.8 degrees, and the one in the regular beer cozy is over 11 degrees now. Fifteen minutes later, uh, beer in the Lolo is 11.1 .1 degrees, and the beer in the beer cozy is 12.9 degrees. Alright, so it's been about 20 minutes now. And we have the Lolo at 12.5 degrees. And the other one at 14.6, so over 2 degrees difference. And I'm going to go ahead and stop this test because one of these beers I can still drink. So two degrees doesn't seem like a lot, but it makes a big difference when you're actually drinking out of it. Um, and keep in mind, this is with a beer cozy on this beer. Uh, if we just left the beer without anything on it out in the sun for this long, it would be hot by now. Uh, the reason the Lolo works so well is because the can is actually suspended uh, from the lid and forms an air barrier around that helps keep it cool longer than a traditional uh, beer cozy. And I've just used a 7-Eleven cup, but the beauty of the Lolo lids is it works on anything that has the same dimensions as a Solo cup. So that could be like a Starbucks cup, a 7-Eleven cup, a Van Hoot, uh, just your basically typical to-go coffee container. 